Previously on The Walking Dead. Whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really. Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Let Ava live. Shoot her. Wait! I said don't shoot Ava! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go to hell, Joan! <coughs> it's Kate! She's coming for us! Oh, shit! Oh, God! While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bone speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to lose. If he plays his last bone... You're out of the will, Javier. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game, since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. You'd all understand. Don't kid yourself. You got lucky. Pfft. Fuck luck. That was skill. Pay up, little brother. If you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Ah, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide! You really should have told us. It's the right thing to do. It's my cancer. I get to do whatever I want. You know now. What difference does it make? How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Please, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. 
That's not okay, Pa. You have to tell her. When the time is right, I, I will. That's not good enough. It's good enough for me. You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mielda. Great. When do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month, another game of dominoes to lose. It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money, I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward! A selfish coward! Javi, can you believe this shit? Just because you're afraid doesn't mean he is, David. It's not always about you. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name. For our blood. For our family. Please, fight. You have to fight, Pa. We don't just give up. Any of us. Okay. Okay? Okay. I'll think about it. Oh, thank you, Pa. Thank you, Javi. Now can we play another game? I'll grab some more beers. So, what are you really gonna do? Truth be told, whatever gets your mother off my ass. You think you two were mad at me for keeping secrets? Hm. But it's good to see you and David on the same side of things, or a change. I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind. Like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their bones. Be brothers before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man. If he tries, I'll try too. That's the best I can do. He will try, Javier, if you show him the way. I still need to pay David. Pa. Oye. If you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're blaming me for all this? I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are.
Kate! Gabe! Kate! Gabe! David! Over here! Where's Kate? She's not here. She must have gotten out. If something's happened to her, if you've gotten her... You better hope she's alive. I thought you didn't want me around anymore. Forget about that. Kate! 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 David, wait! So glad Bobby, you're... Thank God you're all right. I'm just glad you're still in one piece. Huh. Nice driving back there. You know, if you'd swerved a little more, you would have actually hit me. Dang. <laughs> I'll make sure not to miss next time. What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. Uh, There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Javi. Get the knee, like this. Oh, nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? <laughs> yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside! Get in! That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. Hey, Dad. I'm glad you made it out. Joan's probably looking for us. No, she isn't. Javi shot her. What? Good riddance. You were negotiating. I heard you. You didn't have to shoot. Everyone started panicking and shooting. We almost died. You know what Joan's done. Prescott. Mariana, they're gone because of her. I couldn't trust her to keep her word. We'll never know now. Javi's right. Joan had to go. I would have done it too. That's because you don't mind killing people, do you? Those dead guys, they were your friends. Gabe, that's not fair. Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them. David, that's enough. He's not a little boy. He doesn't need that from you. What he needs is to learn to keep his opinions to himself until he understands what the hell he's talking about. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Just be careful, buddy. A lot of muertos out there. Gabe and I will watch each other's backs. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem is with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. On whatever. 
Let's see if there are any other survivors. It'd be good to know who's still around. I don't want to think about how many people may have just died. <sighs> but I guess I'm gonna have to find out eventually. Let's go. Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. We'll get through this. Together. We have for years, right? But what about these people, Javi? They're not as lucky as we are. I did this to them. That hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this as best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible, but I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. You've got a lot of nerve showing up here, after the bullshit you pulled. You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of nerve. Everything that happened is because of you. This is all your fault. I told you, I wanted you out of my life, after what you did to Conrad. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is barely functioning. And before you guys fucked it all up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she... well, fucked us over. But she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying. That counts. Eleanor is one of us. Maybe she forgot it. But I haven't. Thank you, Javi. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Fern. Is that you, darling? I'm here, handsome. Fern and Rufus. What's wrong with him? Bitten. He's slipping in and out of delirium. We have to find Ida. We have to find our daughter. I know that guy. We had a situation. He's lucky I didn't shoot him. Looks like his luck just ran out. Let them have a minute. It's the least we can do. Y'all get over here. You gotta... Cut his arm off! It's too far along. I'm sorry. Bullshit! It can work! I've seen it! Do you want his last moments alive to be more painful than they need to be? I just want to try! I can't lose everyone! Please! I'm begging you! Please! I'll try. Hand over that axe. Thank you! Don't thank me yet.
I told you, he was too far along. The bloodlust didn't help either, I'm sure. I'm sorry. I tried. <laughs> So what can I do? What the- We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. We're- You blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Got my whole fucking family killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid easy ass for... showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! I didn't mean for this to happen. I'm so sorry about your daughter. You can apologize to her face in just a second. Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. Please, forgive both of us. <sighs> <laughs> no! Burn! Holy I'm shit! Fine. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Yeah! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! You... David! What are you doing? This isn't right! David! Oh my god! This is unacceptable! She wasn't gonna shoot! Believe me, she was. Because I would have. No! David! Gabe! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her. She was going for her gun. Look at her! Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up. What the hell is wrong with you? It was over the line, Gabe. You're right. Gabe. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine, then. You people are on your own. Such an asshole. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. David? What are you doing? Thinking it over isn't going to do you any favors. If you want to jump, just jump. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? I'm a lot more afraid of falling. And I'm even more afraid of landing. There's nothing to be afraid of. It'd be over in an instant. My wife, Javi, my son, they look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this.
I thrive in this. Baseball was a lifetime ago. I miss it so fucking much. When I wasn't deployed, I'd miss being out in the field. Now that's all I am. Every day. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? You don't need to change a goddamn thing about yourself. Except thinking that you need to change. Like I said, I wish I had that heart of yours. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now, will you step back? <laughs> sure. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... He was still outside when we checked on the entrances. The muertos were everywhere. We got him inside just in time. So we let him in. There were so many muertos out there. Thank God you're okay, man. I, I was worried. Uh, trip. Uh, about earlier. Yeah, about that. I ain't gonna punch you in the teeth. Though, I got every right. Really? Figured you'd put up a little bit of a fight. Oh, I'd love nothing more, but... I just... Can't shake this slippery feeling I got. Like I'm... Standing in shoes that don't quite fit. You picked me to die, and... Someone else did instead. Ain't sitting right. Not one bit. I don't know what to tell you, man. It was... Fucked up. No doubt. Top to bottom. I keep putting myself in your position. About Conrad, about all of this. Asking myself over and over again whether I'd do the same. I'd love to tell you I wouldn't. I really would. But I can't. If someone threatened my family, I'd shoot them in a heartbeat. Hell, I'd shoot them twice to make sure the lesson stuck. It's a complicated world. But at least there's people to share it with. Bygones? How about it? I'm in if you are. You bet. Bygones. Try not to piss me off again, please. There's so many. They're pouring in. It's even worse than you think. The streets are overrun. Nowhere to go except inside the buildings, and those smelly fuckers are beating down every door. We're sitting goddamn ducks here. Everyone in town is... Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. We watch out for ourselves. We're top priority. Absolutely. The best way to protect ourselves is to protect this place. Potentially, but with the streets compromised, we're gonna need some sort of reinforced mobility to get around. That armored truck you guys stole, there's more vehicles like that in the same place. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. <laughs> Come on, it's an easy jump. 
Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. That can only mean one thing. She likes me more. Not a great time to joke around, Avi. Careful up here, or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Everyone, hold back. Let Hobby and I clear out these walkers. used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. If he asked you again right now, would you say the same? He hasn't asked me yet. your uncle. You told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, here's hoping. I just can't believe your dad said that. It's pretty shitty. He was wrong. You know that. So do I. Took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. We're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. Well, no time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Life is full of surprise. This isn't that bad. I believe in you guys. You can do this. Say nothing. Once we're back on the ground, that's when this shit's really gonna get scary. Got a bad feeling. Oh, good lord. It's nasty down there. My god, it never ends. This shit is way too fucking dangerous. Amen to that. Still, though, I'll take dangerous to dead any day. We have to get across.
I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. There's just one thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? Parenting isn't easy. You give them all you got, they tell you it's not enough, but you love the little shits anyway. Come on, you must have learned that too. I did. That's what makes it even harder to understand, though. After you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> Not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. I miss that brat. Never asked Lingard about it again. Though I've wanted to. Well, sounds like it was your only option. You did the right thing. I hope so. I think about it. Every day. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. Huh. He was a brat, huh? A goofy little brat. You were trying to take care of him. Sometimes that's not so easy. Reminds me of someone who did the same thing for me. You did the right thing. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. What the hell happened here? Well, there's the water tower. Not too far away. No way we're jumping across that. You're not thinking. It's that or go back. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. David. He's got this. She's right. I do. <sighs> Come on, Clem. Your turn. One thing for the kids to swing across, but us? Here's the secret. I guarantee you, you'll be just fine if you follow my advice perfectly. Okay. Whatever you do, don't fall. I'm gonna push you off the side of this thing. 
Well, you can't deny I'm right. All right, David, you're up. You're the little brother. You should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. Ah, oh, come on, you know the drill. Age before beauty. <laughs> you fucker. Last, brother. Trip, you don't have Just to. Just go before I throw you across. Gotta try. We can't just leave him. Y'all head out now. I don't want you seeing oh, this. Trip, no. No. Motherfucker! Trip! No! Ah! He went out fighting. I hope I do too. I'm sorry about your friend, Javi. He seemed like a good guy. The kind of guy you want on your side in a fight. It's priceless. Come on. We're almost there. <laughs> 